Hi. So, I know people say that they have, like, the best friends ever, but I really do. Um, <clears throat> my friend Catherine and my friend Amanda, which, um, if you follow my channel, you probably know of them. Um, they're just awesome. They decided, they, they got in cahoots with my husband and decided to kidnap me for a day and take me to Louisville and like go shopping and they like it was like an early Christmas present and it was just really nice because they they gave me like eighty dollars and we went thrifting and forever 21 and all those crazy stuff the only problem is is that I kept like uncontrollably buying like presents for my family some of which I cannot post on here I'm gonna do um, my kids but I can't do my husband's because he'll watch it and figure out what I got him. But, um, first thing I'll show you is what I got at Hot Topic. The Hot Topic in Louisville, which we have one here. But, um, I don't know. We just decided to go in because I never go to the mall at our... Never go to the mall. Um, so I got me one of these. Um, my husband had one that was actual metal. This was plastic. Um, cheap metal breaks me out really bad. And when I saw this, they had like this um, buy one hair thing or jewelry and get um, another one half off. And so I was like, ooh, this is cool. And then I saw these and I really, really wanted to get them for my daughter because they had a bunch of really cool ones. They had ones with like skulls on them and I didn't want to go too crazy and like scare her grandparents. So I thought, oh, I'll just get like this nice little, nice little cute ones because they kind of go with everything and she's got some money and they're just so cute and they can get this sparkly and I think she'll like them too. This is her Christmas present. One of them anyway. I got her quite a few things. Um, they also had a Disney store. Louisville has two malls and in one of them, I don't know what it was called, but they had a Disney store and we used to have a Disney store when, um, I think they got rid of it when I was in like fifth grade or something. But it was so heartbreaking because, like, I rarely ever went to the mall, but when I did, I was like, the Disney store, oh, my God. And so, like, it was, like, walk down memory lane when I saw the Disney store there, and I was like, oh, my God. Oh. I was, like, so excited. And then, um, we went to Forever 21. I only got one thing of Forever 21. I'm probably going to, you know, get a bunch of hate mail for saying this, but I really don't see what the big deal is. I mean, if you're not a, you know, if, if you don't have a pretty slender body type, there's really nothing for you there. I, I have, you know, a big chest and a booty and some lumps and layers that, you know, I just can't wear a lot of their stuff. It's not, I'm not saying I don't like it. I like a lot of their outfits. In fact, they had a pair of pants there that I really liked that I fit in. But it wasn't on sale, and it was like $25, and I'm just not, I'm a thrifter, so I'm not one, I can't, I can't buy that much. Like, I could get so much, like, I could get, like, six to eight things with that same amount of money going thrifting, and that just seems kind of ridiculous to me, just get one article of clothing, no matter how amazing it is. I guess if, maybe if it were a dress or a jacket, I might be more inclined to get them, but, I mean, they were really cool pants. They were... Like a burgundy red with a black leopard print. And they were like skinny jeans. And they were pretty awesome. But I'm just not willing to pay that much. Um, so I got one thing. It was on sale. I think it was $7.99. It's really pretty. And I like the little bows. In fact, it wasn't even something I originally picked up. I tried on like a bunch of different things. And this one... <clears throat> I kept seeing, I think somebody had tried it on and it didn't fit, or, or it did fit, and they just decided last minute not to get it, and they just hung it on this rack, like right outside the changing room, and I walked by it maybe three times, and not, like my last run going in, I was like, yeah, I'll just, I'll just try it on, see how it works, it actually fit pretty good, and it had kind of like a, <clears throat> excuse me, it's like a Drew Barrymore feel to it, I don't know if I'm the only one who feels that way, but... I like it. It's feminine. So, you know, I'm not saying Forever 21 sucks. I'm just saying it's not my favorite place. Um, this 
It's actually from Forever 21, but I get it at the thrift store for about three dollars. So snick snack snarl. How do you feel about them grapes? I'm I'm just saying, man, go thrifting. You're likely to find the stuff you can get at regular stores at the thrift store. They're just like way cheaper. I don't know. I guess I just feel like people keep shoving Forever 21 down my throat and they're just like, it's so amazing, you have to go there. I'm like, yeah, they got really cool stuff, but if you have boobs, you're screwed. Alright, I've said my thing, I'm done ranting. Um, we also went to this Goodwill in Louisville. It was pretty big, they had quite a selection of clothes. And I, I'm never good at finding pants, but man, these pants are navy blue and they have stripes on the inside and all these little buttons and they fit perfect they're a little long but um i'm cool with that normally i don't like really long pants and they kind of flare out and i'm normally not into that i really actually hate that but i guess because they're not jeans it looked okay I, I was i was willing to overlook and i think they're like two fifty three dollars really not that bad um, this little thing I got for my son. It's a little llama. Um, I don't know. I think it was Catherine who found this. Correct me if I'm wrong. I'm sorry. Um, if Amanda found it. Um, but it's a little llama and it's really soft. And, you know, it's like, what do you get a baby for Christmas? They're not going to care about Christmas until they're at least two. So, I got him a little llama. I think it was more so for me than for him. It's just so cute. <laughs> And then, okay, they had, we went to this, like, little mini thrift store. I don't remember what it was called. I'm sure my friends know because they're better at stuff like that. But they had all this amazing furniture. They had so much stuff that I wanted. I wanted to take all of it home. Like, I think of Amanda, my friend, it was her car. Like, if it would have been bigger, we would have, like, came home with a bunch of furniture. Um, I did end up getting these two gold, like, mini shelving unit things. Well, they only hold, like, they could hold three picture frames down in a row, and they have, like, gold leaves on them. I would show it to you. Um, the lighting in my room's not so good, and I was so excited when I got them that I immediately put them up. In fact, I, like, rearranged my room, and it looks really pretty now. So exciting. Except I can't sleep in there because my son, um, isn't quite... He sleeps through the night, but he isn't used to his bed quite yet, though. So, he's... I don't know. I just can't. I mean, I have to stay in the living room for now until we get that figured out. But soon. It's soon. And uh, so I don't know how I'm going to. It'd probably be easier if it just took the camera. So it just looks like a dark, like, door. But it's actually. Hold on. Okay. Sorry. It's like a little shelf unit. And my original idea was to make it into a dollhouse for my daughter. But I actually already have a dollhouse for her that my dad had made when my sister and I were kids. So I decided I'm going to give her that for Christmas instead. And with this, um, I don't know, like, it could be something for jewelry or a spice rack. But I don't really need either of those. I'm good on both of those accounts. So I kind of want to like hang it up on my wall and I don't know, maybe I'll put like my owl collection in it. How sad would that be? <laughs> oh, like crazy lady with all the owl stuff. That's me. So I mean other than the shopping, uh, it was pretty cool. I mean we went, we hung out at the malls and my friend got her like makeup done and and uh, I'd say the only bad thing about the trip was I had a bad sinus headache but you know what it was worth it I still had a really good time so yay okay